Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl, T. So I want to come out here and talk about the whole Safari Samuel situation, honey. So if you guys don't know, the other day he was performing at Dykeman Park in New York. And as we all know, New Yorkers are a tough crowd to play for, okay? Either they're filling your ass or they're not, okay? Anyways, he starts performing his track, and basically the crowd is not feeling it. They start booing him, and instead of him to keep going on and not letting that get to him and try to win the crowd over, he then proceeds to stop the music and basically sit and brag about how he's fucking bad bitches that many in the crowd have dreamed of this entire situation was just corny as fuck go ahead and check out this video and i'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary hold on let me tell you young niggas something i fuck bitches y'all dream about i fuck bitches y'all niggas dream about i fuck bitches y'all niggas wish you stop. i make money i'm dead All right, so y'all just seen that corny ass shit that Safari did. Now, what I find funny about this entire situation, like I was saying on Instagram, is this is the same man that's been on the shade room and on his Instagram profile, crying about wanting a wife, crying about wanting to settle down, crying about wanting a child. But then as soon as the crowd does something he doesn't like, he decides to throw bitches and pussy in their face. You know what I'm saying? This entire situation is just childish. This man is what, 36 or 37 years old, but yet and still that's his rebuttal. I just think all that is corny and it just goes to show that many of these celebrities they're not truly happy because again if he was really happy with himself and really content with his life that's nothing that you throw into somebody's face okay that's something that you would hear a 16 or 17 year old saying not a grown ass man to other grown ass people hence why after he said that they then started throwing bottles and objects at his ass to get his ass off the stage so that entire situation was a hot damn mess what grown man even brags about who he smashed in order to make a point okay at some point in time you have to grow up you know what i mean if people are not feeling your music all that means is that either you just need to be a ghostwriter or go back to the drawing board and try it again okay so anyways y'all let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation once again concerning safari getting booed at dykeman and do you agree with what he said do you feel like what he said was just lame and corny do you feel like the crowd was wrong for booing him so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right, deuces. Nikki! Hey, you guys, it's your girl T, and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.